ever deleted a photo and instantly regretted it? Let me show you how you can get those memories back. Hey everyone, it's Josh here from Stella, and today I'll be taking you through a step-by-step -step guide on how to recover deleted photos on Windows, Mac, Android, SD cards, and finally on an iPhone. As well as explaining what software is out there to help you recover photos that you may have thought were completely lost to the world. Now, as I'll be talking through the devices one by one, feel free to skip to your relevant device. Timestamps will be in the description below. Though, do make sure that you watch to the final section for the easiest method of them all. But for now, let's get started. Windows. With Windows, it's thankfully incredibly easy to recover any photos that you may have accidentally deleted. You first need to head to your recycling bin, which should be visible as a shortcut on your home screen. Once opened, you can select the image or images that you wish to recover, then simply right-click on those selected and then click Restore. This will restore the images back to their original folder. You can also simply drag the images back into your folder of choice. Be warned, Windows deletes photos automatically after 30 days in the recycling bin, so just beware of that. Another way of recovery for Windows is with the help of the Windows built-in backup and restore utility. As long as you regularly backup your computer files, you should have no problem with restoring your photos by following this simple guide. Connect an external storage device to your PC to store your photos. Then select Control Panel and go to Backup and Restore. Choose either Restore My Files or Restore All User Files, then select the deleted images you wish to retrieve. Once done so, click Browse for Files or Browse for Folder. Hit Next. Then you can restore those selected images to the storage device. Mac. When it comes to Macs, the easiest way is very similar to Windows, by restoring photos from your trash. The way you do this is by heading to your trash bin and finding the photos you wish to restore. Right click on them and select the Put Back option. This will restore your selected photos back into their original destination. The second way is by using the Photos app backup. If you do happen to store your images in the Photos app that is. To restore these, you must first open the app and open the recently deleted section. Select the desired photos. These will then have a blue tick once selected. Click Recover and this will send it to the original destination. Do bear in mind, any images left in the recently deleted section will automatically be deleted after 30 days. Thirdly, if you happen to use the Time Machine app, this one's for you. Head to the Time Machine option in the menu bar. Choose Enter Time Machine. Time Machine will open up and show you all available backups that you may have. You can then select the date of your last backup and navigate to your photo library backup and select it. Simply then hit Restore. In doing so, your photos should be now restored. SD card. For those of you who use an SD card, this section is for you. Now, sometimes, when connecting your SD card to an infected PC, it may completely hide all of your photos. If this does happen to you, you must first connect your SD card to your PC. Open Windows Explorer and click Tools. Go to the Folder Options and select View. Once done so, open Show Hidden Photos. Uncheck Hide and then you will be able to access your photos once again. Now, in some extreme circumstances, when opening your SD card, it may show an error message. If this does so, following these steps may help fix this error. First, click Start from your Windows taskbar and choose My Computer. Go to Devices, followed by Removable Storage, and locate your SD card. But make sure you note the drive letter this device has been assigned. Open the command prompt by typing CMD into the search box and click Run as Administrator. In the command prompt window, type CHKDSK. Add the letter of the SD card, so check disk E or F, as an example, and hit enter. This command will check for possible errors within your SD card and attempt to fix them. It may not necessarily work, but it is worth giving it a go. Android. Okay, away from the computers now, let's talk about mobile phones, starting with the Android operating system. Like most other devices, the first method starts by heading to your gallery app recycling bin. You do this by opening your device's gallery app, then selecting the recycling bin folder. Another method, depending on your device, is by clicking on the three dots in the top right hand corner of your screen and selecting recycling bin. Once in the bin, you simply select the photos that you want to restore and click restore. This will then return the images to their original folder. The second method is for those of you that back your device up to Google's Drive app. You begin by opening the Google Drive app on your smartphone, then this will instantly show all of your images that have been backed up. 
Select the photos that you wish to restore to your device and tap download. This will then download your images, placing them in your download folder. Another Google app that you may use is Google Photos. So let's talk you through that. Open the Google Photos app on your device and sign into your Google account, and then select the photo you wish to restore. Click More, followed by Download, to save the photos back onto your device. iPhone. If you're an iPhone user and you've lost your photos, then let's go through the options that you have for recovering those lost memories. First up, like most devices out there, you can attempt to find them in your recently deleted folder. Nice and simple this one, just go to your Photos app, head to Albums, then Recently Deleted. Find the missing photo, then tap on it to recover. Simple. Next up, using your iTunes backup, though this one does require a PC or a Mac. Once on your desktop device, launch iTunes, select your iPhone under the device list, and select the recent backup data. Click Restore Backup, and that should be the job done. A third option is by using your iCloud backup. Regardless of what type of device that you're on, you can head to iCloud.com and sign into your iCloud account. Click on Photos, then Albums at the top. Find the recently deleted album, select the images that you want to retrieve within this folder, then click Recover to get your desired photos returned to you. Stellar. Now, all of those methods are well and good for images that you may have accidentally deleted. But what do you do if you want to recover an image that's been lost due to corruption or viruses? Well, Stellar Photo Recovery can certainly help you with this one. Using a simple, easy to use interface, Stellar Photo Recovery can help restore anything from simple JPEG images all the way to Ultra HD and 8K videos. Supported by some of the most popular camera brands in the world, Stellar Photo Recovery can be used across a number of different devices, from Macs and PCs, phones and tablets. Don't worry if you happen to be an iPhone user, here at Stellar we've created your own separate software so you don't miss out on recovering lost memories. Right now, there is a free trial available to everyone to see if our software is for you. And once you've decided that you love it, there are three price plans available to suit all budgets. Follow the link in the description below for all the information that you need to help make up your mind. So that's all from me today. I do hope that these guides have proved to be useful to you all. Please let us know in the comments if you have any further questions regarding anything that we've said in today's video, and we'll make sure to get them answered for you. I've been Josh from Stella, and I'll see you next time.